So y'all, when I saw this online, I was like, okay, Walmart. It's Anita, and today I want to share with you guys some coats and jackets that I picked up for this fall and winter. So if you're interested, stick around. All right, first up is this cute cream coat that I got from H&M. Excuse the thing they still left on here. I did not realize until just now that they left it on here because I actually exchanged it yesterday. Um, they have two different lengths in this coat, and initially I got the longer one, which is like knee length. But when I came home and I was trying it on, I felt like I had on a bathrobe. But I said, you know what, let me get the shorter version. So I exchanged it and I didn't realize they left this thing on there till today as I was about to film. So yeah, it does have the tie waist detail and it has two hidden buttons here. And this one has, um, I don't know what this kind of collar is called. Now I will say the longer one has a full um, collar that you can like flip and button and this one has a shorter collar that's the only difference but for my tall girls they do have a longer one if you prefer a longer trench or for my shorter girls if that's what you like I just like this length because the other one felt like a bathrobe so I really like this color and I'm excited to so yeah cute cream love all right so next up I got this black simple coat as well from H&M um, I did also start out with the longer version of this. Um, this one does come down a little bit longer than the cream one, but they do have one that comes down ankle length on me. I got that one at first, and again, I got home, I got to trying it on, and I was like, girl, this just looks ridiculous on you. So I went back and exchanged it for this shorter one. It's still long, just not as long as the other one, and I like this a lot better on my um, height. So. Try them out to see which one you guys prefer. Or for my short girls, comment down below and let me know if you guys like the longer trenches or the shorter one. I'm just finding that the long ones make me feel like I have on a bathrobe and I just I just don't like it. I love it on other people, but when I put it on, I'm like, girl, that's not, it, it's not hidden like it do on other people. So anyway, yeah, got this one from H&M and I believe a size large as well. All right, next up, I got this beautiful cognac color jacket from good old Target and it was only $40, y'all. I love this. Um, I don't know what material this is, but it is very soft. It's pretty lightweight, um, so I will say if it's really cold outside, you're gonna need a sweater with this one. But I thought it was really cute and $40, I just thought you couldn't beat it, so really cute has the tie waist detail and it does have one hidden button at the waist and yeah i think i got this one in a large but i will have every um sizing that i got down below because i know i'm probably gonna mess this up <laughs> but yeah love this cognac color isn't this color gorgeous y'all i was so excited to get this from shein um it does come with this long tie waist detail i'm not even gonna call it tie waist it has it's this situation i don't know what this is called i tied it all the way just to give y'all the full effect but it does have that and it has these four buttons here actually i think it has six buttons yeah it can button all the way up to here i'm not gonna do all of that but it does come up pretty far and yeah i love this color and y'all already know it was from shein so it wasn't expensive i don't remember how much it was but again i'll have it linked down below um yeah this is pretty lightweight um it's not it is a jacket but again if it's super cold outside or very windy you will definitely need a sweater underneath but again it's from shein so we already know you know but yeah i thought this was really cute especially for the color yeah i love this jacket y'all let me know what you think would you rock it or is it too light <laughs> so y'all when i saw this online i was like okay walmart yeah right love the plum color um i will say this is a heavy coat um this is not what you just throw on to go to brunch or whatever like unless it's actually cold this has some weight to it so this is not just a throw on and go type of coat this is i need a coat so I'll put this on type of coat um it does come all the way up here you can button it all the way up and it also does have the high waist deep the high waist the tie waist detail as well and um yeah i think i got this one in a size extra large i believe 
I'll have it down below the correct size, but I think I got an extra large. And y'all, I will say for Walmart, this jacket was $100. But when I got it, I was like, oh, I see why, because it's a pretty heavy duty coat. Now, I live in Texas, it doesn't get crazy cold, but you know, it gets cold enough, like this would definitely do in the cold. If I didn't have on a sweater underneath this coat, I would be okay, because this is a heavy coat. So, um, it is $100, but this is a coat. This is not a fashion coat, this is a, it's cold outside. Let me go ahead and grab that, okay? <laughs> so, I think it's worth $100. Um, but yeah, this is really cute. Walmart came through with this one. What y'all think? Would you buy it? I picked up this beautiful hunter green coat from Zara. Um, y'all, I love this jacket. I just, I've had it about two weeks now, and I've worn it at least five times. Like, if it's cold enough and I need to grab something, I grab this. Even though it is a coat, it is very lightweight. Um, it's very soft. That's another thing I love about it. And I just feel like this Hunter Green, I've worn it with a lot of different colors. And I wear a lot of neutrals, so I just feel like I can throw it on with anything. And um, yeah, I love this. They did have it in a few different colors. I know I saw it in the store. I got it in the store. I saw camel, I saw black, I saw cream. And I feel like I saw a plum color. Don't quote me on that. But I did get it at the store. But if they are in stock online, I would definitely link it down below. I did get an extra large. Um, this one does not have any tie waist detailing and it doesn't have any buttons. It does have pockets though. Um, but yeah, I love this jacket. So I definitely say these are worth, you know, checking it out if you're looking for something cute and lightweight that you can just throw on and go. All right, y'all, so I'm back with another Walmart special. Yes, Walmart, y'all. They've they been coming through with a few items, honey. I love, love, love this cognac color um, faux um, suede, faux suede moto jacket. Number one, the biggest thing that I loved about this is the fact that it had gold detailing. I am a sucker for gold. And you know, most um, um, faux leather jackets and suede jackets and stuff come with the silver detailing. So I was very excited they had gold because I love me some gold. I feel like it looks good against this cognac color. Um, love everything about it. It does zip here. And um, this is just kind of a lightweight jacket. Um, can I zip it? Hold on now. Okay, about to say. <laughs> but yeah, it does zip all the way up. I believe I got a 1X or extra large. And yeah, I love this. I've worn this twice already too, because I've had most of these jackets for at least two or three weeks or so. But yeah, I've worn this twice already. I love it. It's very soft. It is lined. Um, yeah, I definitely think you should check this out. Walmart is, I mean, they step in the game. I don't know what they got going, but whatever they got going, I like it. <laughs> All right, y'all. So when I saw this, I just immediately thought of Cookie Lions. <laughs> and um, I just said, why not? It was from Shein, so you know it wasn't expensive. And um, yeah, I just picked it up. I don't have any faux fur. So yeah, um, got it in red. I think that was the only color they had because I really would have liked this in like a hunter green color. I thought that would be cute. But um, yeah. Just cute faux fur. I didn't really have any rhyme or reason for it, but I just showed y'all in case you're interested. I don't know if I'm gonna keep it just yet, so let me know what y'all think. Should I keep it or is it just a little bit too much? Let me know your thoughts. <laughs> I picked up this cute little faux leather moto jacket from Express. The first thing that I loved about it was just that it is so soft. Frisbee faux leather, this is really, really soft. Um, it is heavily lined. This is a nice, um, option when it is pretty cool outside now it's not of course as heavy as, as leather leather but it does have a little bit of weight to it the only thing that i do not like about these types of jackets that have um that come with this little belt i just don't like this so when i wear it i honestly just take the belt part out and wear it without um and i also have another faux leather jacket that doesn't have this it has like the little snap closures and i do prefer those because i like the silhouette of it i like for it to be a bit more fitted but um, I do have one that is a bit more fitted, but it's like fitted fit. <laughs> so I got this one because when it is a bit cooler and I want to wear it, I can wear this one with my thicker, heavier um, sweaters and stuff like that. Like I can layer and put this on with my other one. I can't really layer because it's, it's you know, fitted fit. <laughs> so yeah, got this one as well from Express. 
All right, beauty, so I'm interested to know if you guys have started buying any jackets this fall and winter. Are you planning on buying any or if y'all just kind of holding off and waiting since we're still in this quarantine COVID situation and things are a bit uncertain. So comment down below and let me know. As well as I will have all of the links to the coats that I got down below. And I also found a lot of other cute jackets and coats that I didn't buy, but I thought they were really cute and they had great deals. So if you're not already, if you're not already, follow me on the Like to Know It app. I will have the information in the description box below as well as in the sidebar here. Um, I did find a lot of cute jackets and a lot of cute deals, but I just can't buy everything. So I did leave some for y'all. <laughs> All right, as well as follow me on Instagram at the Nita Danielle. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.